Since my iMac isn't booting right now, I'm going to make the tutorial on my laptop. First one I've ever done. Today, I'm going to show you an application that allows you to make Windows transparent. For instance, you can see my desktop right now, and I can obviously adjust the transparency. But not only that, but let's say I make this window tinier, and I've got a YouTube video playing, so let's, let's go over to YouTube right now. Oh, just got a text. We'll go over to YouTube and we'll watch one of my tutorials, Inventor Kit. Oh, look at that. I'm even in the suggestions now. Thank you, YouTube. We'll watch my use NTFS hard drives on a Mac. I'm just going to mute it for the sake of this tutorial so you don't have to listen. But we see there, got the video playing. And if I uh, go Control Command, three finger swipe up, it does that little weird cloud image, which means it is now floating on top of anything else I do. So I'm going to go ahead and open iTunes. I can click in iTunes, I'm controlling iTunes, while Skype stays on top. Oh, sorry, I just saw Skype. While my YouTube video stays on top. So it allows me to keep Windows afloat. I can easily turn that off by going Control command 3 finger down swipe. Then I'm back to iTunes. Note that this application called Afloat only works in Cocoa applications, which means iTunes is not one of them. To see if an application is a Cocoa app, in it, go Window, and if you see the Afloat menu, it is obviously an, a Cocoa application. For instance, iTunes, Window, does not exist. Finder, Window, does not exist. It only works within um, Cocoa apps, which are really third-party apps, any app. So Skype, um, two-finger drag, uh, two-finger scroll, command, control, two fingers is adjust transparency. I'll just close out of that, close out of this. We'll open up. I'll show you a useful one for this. I was using it just before this tutorial, so I'm just going to ask her to come back. Thank you. All right, so Samantha has said yes to allowing me, so I'm just going to show you here. We'll drag down. You can see Samantha while I can still browse Facebook. I can go to my profile, view my stuff, and Samantha can wave to me right now if she wants. Wave. Do it. See? And, and you can still see Samantha. I had her mute herself for the purpose of this tutorial. But, uh, yeah, very cool app. It's free, and it's called Afloat. Just Google the words Afloat. And yes, sorry Windows user, users, it is only for Mac. And go to the first one, it's by infinitelabs.net. They're constantly thinking of amazing apps. Um, currently, I guess they only have a float, but oh well, who knows. Um, and just click download it. It will add many features to... So here, here's all the things. You can keep Windows... You can keep Windows afloat. Heh on top of all other windows. You can pin windows to the desktop. That's new. I didn't know that. You can move windows from anywhere, not just the title bar. Turn a window into an overlay so your screen on your screen that doesn't hinder your work. Show a Windows file in the finder with nothing more than your keyboard. I don't I didn't know about half of these. And best of all, it is free. So download now, it's for Snow Leopard. Go ahead and do that and uh, comment, rate, subscribe if you liked it. Thanks, Samantha, for the purpose of this tutorial, and I'm going to hang up on her because I can do that. All right, so thank you guys, and uh, be sure to subscribe to my other channel, InventorKid13 iPhone. Um, not a lot is on there. It's mainly more personal uh, video uploading, but go ahead and subscribe to it anyways. Thanks for watching.